some kind of danger. Luciano, you're my son, and I love you with all my heart. So I need you to know that everything I did, right or wrong, I did out of love for you and your mother. I'm begging you only this, Luciano. Never forget how much I love you both. You're acting like I'm never going to see you again. Listen, I need you to hear me. This is what I want you to remember. Keep it in your mind and in your heart when you hear what they say about me. Remember, just this is true, Damien. Look, when the time is right, we'll see each other again. I just can't say when that will be. I haven't let you be Romeo. Dad. Be careful. Where are you? At Damien's office. Is he there? Not anymore. Do you know why he's leaving town? Is that what he told you? Yes. So you saw him? Yeah, he, he just left. He said that he needed to see me, so I came. He was packing a bag. Dad, I think he's running away from something. He had his passport, his visa. He told me that he wasn't going to see me for a long time and that he loved me and Mom. Do you have any idea what's going on? Yeah, yeah, I do. But I can't get into it on the phone. Listen, you need to get over to the hospital and be with your mother. What? Is, is she okay? Yeah, yeah, she's fine. You know what? When it's all over, I'll tell you everything that happened. Okay, I'm on my way. Look, did Damien tell you how he's planning on leaving the country? He said something about a freighter. Okay, listen, your mom's here at the hospital on the fourth floor. I'll, uh, I'll talk to you later. So I'm still blind, right? Never heard that one before. Sorry. Oh, it's good. You're gonna need that sick sense of humor during your post-op recovery phase. Wait. Does that mean you're gonna operate? I'm cautiously optimistic that I can reverse your condition. <laughs> oh, my God. I, no, I, I need you to listen to me. I'm going to have to come up with some therapy protocols. I'm not going to go any further with this unless I can do that. And even then, I need you to be prepared to be let down. Because I'm not guaranteeing anything with or without the surgery. You got it? I do. I, I really do. There's something else that has to be in place if I'm going to agree to do this. And it's a deal breaker. Name it. Keep Mr. Snyder out of my orbit. Deal? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, deal. You're here. I live here. Yeah. What are you doing? Uh, I was just gonna make you dinner since you've been so busy. Huh. What's that smell? Mulled cider. You want some? No, 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 no. no thanks. Say, uh, you look relaxed. I am. You hear that? No, I don't hear anything. Exactly. Jake has been sleeping all afternoon. I went to a new doctor who gave him antibiotics. Oh. So he's sleeping. I got back from work, mulled some cider, and fixed the fridge. It's a full day. Mm -hmm. What did you do? I talked to my sister. Oh, how's Maddie? She's as wise as an owl. Uh, in fact, uh, you told me about something that I should do that might help you. What's that? Give me your foot. Come on. No, I like sisters. I really do. I, they're important. I like most of my sisters, and uh, I, I like Margot too. Even though she's arrested me so many times, sisters should be close. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, but uh, roommates as adults, I mean, that's a little too close, don't uh. you think? I mean, uh, I mean, take this for example, this, this foot massage. I mean, his sister would, would never do this on demand. She wouldn't even offer it. Mm, am I this yeah. one? Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. Yeah, that's why I think you need someone a, a little, a little more, a little less related. More disinterested. Yes, more disinterested. No, 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 not disinterested. More, um, more caring, more loving, more, uh, more doting. Oh. Someone uh, who could uh, take care of Jacob. Mm, totally. Yes, take care of him when he's sick. When he's not sick. Oh, exactly. Someone who could take out the trash. Uh huh. Mm. Katie, I'm, I'm really, I'm really happy you feel that way. Mm. Because it's something I can. Keyworks. Great. 
So, what do you think? Yeah, that'll do. I'm in. Perfect. Excuse me, who are you? Henry Coleman, this is Dr. Reed Oliver. My new roommate. Bella? Luke? What are you doing here by yourself? I'm waiting for Maddie. Why are you here? Um, my dad called. Something happened to my mom. Oh, is she okay? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Did you, uh, find Dr. Oliver? Yeah, I found him all right. Uh, that bad, huh? Oh, it's that good. He said as long as the therapy progresses, he might actually go through with the surgery on me. He said all that? Yeah. Oh, no, I'm so happy for you. Let me go check on my mom, and, th and then we I'll drive you home. Um, actually, you know, go with Maddie. But we got so much to talk about. Fine, you can't wait ten minutes for me? No, I can't, and, um... You're gonna have to get used to that. What are you saying? Dr. Oliver doesn't want you around him at all, Luke. <laughs> Ever. Meaning? Meaning, we have to stay away from each other, starting right now. Damien. Good to just let it be, huh? You have everything now. Why don't you just let me go? No. I can't do that. Not this time.